What is going on, guys? Self Zeta Carson here. I'm back to play The Wolf Among Us. Now, I know this game was out for a while now. I know I'm kind of playing this late. So, Angel Arch, don't hold this on me. I didn't watch your videos. Yeah, he did this before me because he had the extra time. But if you saw my move in day of on my channel where I moved into col uh, like a state college in my dorms and everything, you would know that I can't always play video games now. I actually gotta focus on schoolwork, studies, etc. But let's get to the point. Okay, so I'm gonna do my three warnings if you are new to this because, well, this is the start of episode two, so I'm assuming you know what what my three rules are. Warning number one: I will all I do use foul language, so if you do not like foul language, please do not watch this. I do not want to be held responsible. Warning number two: I will never use the F word. If I do use the F word, I will apologize. I couldn't hold it in me. It was it's in my system already. There's not much I can do. You know, it it, it could happen any time if I can't control it. Instead of the F word, I will replace the word with fudge, like a fudge sundae, which I'm pretty sure my roommates will love to have one day. And warning number three, I will be playing this blind, so I have no idea what's going to happen in this story. My decisions will be on my choosing, and yeah, I might make a stupid mistake, like you guys will be saying, you should have done this, or I should have done that, or you should have, this was the right choice, or this was the bad choice. I'm going to be making decisions on my own judgment, pretty much. Let me see something. Okay, I'm right here. This is where I want to be. Alright, so guys, let's get this a shot. Now, if you haven't watched my Wolf Among Us episode 1, please, I don't recommend you watching episode 2 until you've watched episode 1. So let's get this show on the road. Yeah! I, I have forgotten so much about this already. I feel like an idiot. Mr. Uh, Toad? Oh. Do something, Bigby. Uh oh. Before he completely tears up the place. All right, I'll go take a look at this. Hmm, let me see. Hey! Whoa, Stop whoa, whoa! Hey, hey! Ooh! You got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid? <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus You're Christ, Aaron! Not as bad as everyone says you are. Ooh, Please, nice. Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Okay, I promise. I promise. Thank you. For trusting me. I'll trust you for now. Have I don't seen know. Have seen my scum. wife? Have you seen Beauty? No, I haven't. Come with me. Okay, I'll come with you. <gasps> it's her. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. Wow, that guy's an ass. I remember it. I'm D. He's dumb. Twiddle D, twiddle dumb. Ooh! But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill more than one. I'm, I'm looking for the guy. woodsman. Well, he's not here. Holly, you're out of paper towels and the... Uh, Hi there, You're gonna buddy. string me up, baby. You said it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. Uh -huh. All right. I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl named... Fuck, Ooh! This fucking lab dog. He comes sniffing around this part of the rich fucks in the woods. Need to shake oh, him. yeah, I remember this fight. Yeah, it was right awesome. Big, big, big. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. I remember the scene. Oh, God, I was so freaking out. But then, I don't know, Um, I got confirmed by my reading that she's not really dead. You'll know what I'm talking about soon. Oh, what's going on here? This is a little edgy. Oh. Jesus Lord! I just like how it's just this moment in suspense. Yes, Snow White. No. You're making this more difficult than it has to be. If you just cooperate and answer the questions, you can go home. Maybe get some sleep. I don't sleep. How are you feeling? How am I feeling? I know it's been a long night for you. You look like you could use some rest. Uh, I, 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 I need to find the killer. I'll be better when I find who did this. 
which I can't do while sitting in here. Yeah. We all want the same thing here, Big B. Yes. Wait. Oh, yeah, yeah that's right. Look, that's his name. Big Bag Wolf's Big I B. I know what you must be going through. Really, I do. No, you don't. But I could use your cooperation. I don't think you do, yeah. You know, I hate to say it, but I don't think you do. Of course. You're... you're right. I can't imagine what you're going through right now. Exactly. I can read you like an open book, Missy. I know they're watching me! I can see you! Oh, by the way, I flipped a coin to decide heads or tails to see if I should do a webcam or not. with you cops? Always trying to empathize with people. Wow, yeah. I know this must be hard for you. Do you? Do you fucking know? Have you had a friend killed and their head left at your fucking doorstep? Yeah! Yeah, just say something to that. Come on. Come no, on. Didn't think so. Yeah, I thought so, Missy. I flipped a coin to see heads or tails, which if I should use a webcam or not. Your and nose is you bleeding. obviously see. Whoa. Are you okay? Are you okay? You don't look so good. Detective Brannigan? I'm Detective Brannigan. Uh, yeah. I know. I, I just said that. Is there something? Wait. There's something going on. Yeah. There's something going on here. What the frick? Please. Please. <laughs> Ooh, what the frick? I'm sorry. Just make it stop. Please. Um, what the fudge does happen? I was hearing some weird noise too, and she just passed out. We have to go now. What did you do to her? Yeah. What did you do to her? She'll be fine. It's just a memory wipe spell. Very expensive, but it works. The whole station will forget the last 24 hours and everything they saw at the woodlands. Well, hurry up. Okay, okay, okay. Is that my phone or is that somebody else's phone? I think it's the game's phone. Jesus Christ, I thought I was in trouble here for a minute. Um, I think I should take that photo or else... Yeah, the, good call. I flipped a coin, heads or tails, to see if I should use a webcam. You can obviously see what won. I chose not to. We landed on tails. Alright. Let's do this! 24 hours memory wipe? Good call. But I'm so sad, Miss... Snow White is dead! Who is she? <gasps> and they actually drive cars. Then again, they have to live in the no normal world. <clears throat> Thanks for the bailout. Yeah, exactly. Thanks for bailing me out. Certainly. At least he's... We, um, I'm being we nice. We found Tweedledee chained up to a post. That was your doing, correct? Yeah. Well, I don't know why you detained him. Dee was at the trip trap when Snow was left at the woodlands, so he couldn't possibly be involved in this mayhem. He might have information, yeah. Bluebeard's currently interrogating him, and he hasn't said anything useful. And, Big B, we have to tread carefully here. We can't implicate an innocent man. And people are already worried about your conduct. He's working for somebody. And whoever it is wants him snooping around every crime scene I've looked at. That doesn't necessarily mean they're involved in the murders. Yeah, it kind of does, you know. He might know something, at least. And I want to know what, he's, what he knows. I think that's a right, fair judge. That's a fair judgment, you know. He's snooping around the crime scenes. He's hot, He knows something. I know what you're thinking, Big B. It's been one full night and a slice of morning, and I already miss her too. I know my heart's sad. I was like, no. I was really shocked at the ending of episode one. You know, I never get more homesick than when one of us dies. Uh -huh. Now, for it to be snow, I've never been good with these sorts of things. I just can't believe this it's is hard. really happening. Yeah, it's hard. You know, sympathize with the guy. He's Touch, getting to his emotional side. Our stories used to be so simple. We had a beginning, a middle, and an end. Yeah, 
that's true. But ever I... since we moved to this awful city, everything's gotten so confused. Well, it's not that bad. Is it? Really? Did she um, give any indication to what she was thinking? When you saw her last, I mean. I don't know why, but I'd like to know that she was... She I guess want... fine, I suppose. She wanted me to change things, yeah. She I could think... come off as callous sometimes, but she wasn't really. She said that she wanted to change things. Make it easier for Fables to get help when they need it. Yeah, exactly. I think that's what she said. I don't know what else to say, Big B. We have to... I have to put an end to this. Well, you're gonna help me, right? If you don't help me, we're pretty much screwed. Two murders in as many days. If we don't unearth our culprit, and soon, there will likely be another on our doorstep tonight. I'll get it done. Please, Bigby. For Miss White. I got it. Gee, whoa! You cracked my window! How dare you? You're paying for that! Ah, shit. <laughs> okay. Right to an attorney. That's not a very good answer, is it? Come on, just tell me what I want to know. It will make things a lot less painful for you, in theory. Oh, were you planning on using that? I just thought you really liked rubbing your little sword. Ooh. What the hell do you think you're doing? Hello, Ichabod. Ichabod. Sheriff. Bluebeard. Beard. I was just chatting with our new friend. You were supposed to wait for us to get back. I told you, if you want to be involved, you will do things my way. No violence! Okay. Whatever you say, Ichabod. I don't like that guy's smile or look. He looks evil. Hello, Big B. Hello, I Big B. I want answers, D. Oh, goody. I thought you wanted questions, and I was having so much trouble thinking of any good ones. Though I'd settled on, how's your head? You see what I've been dealing with? What are you going to do about this, Bigby? It's... this isn't a joke. You think this is a joke? Snow White is dead. Look, I didn't kill anyone. And I'm supposed to just believe you. You were with me when it happened, dummy. This is true. I still have questions for you, D. Sounds like a personal problem. Who's it's your boss? Ridiculous. Yeah, who's your boss? Let him work. He's got more experience with these kinds of things. Back in the alley, you mentioned your employer. Who is it? Who are you working for? <laughs> Why? You looking to change your occupation? You know what? Hit him. He's not gonna... You'd be good at it, I think. He's not gonna tell me. Now tell me! All right, D. Let's get to know each other. Well, you're not gonna tell me, so I might as well... Come on, Big B. Let's take a good look. Yeah, show the photo to D. Yeah, show it. Fuck, Big B. Don't make me look at that. Psychological. Just put that away. Please. Um, who should I choose? I don't want to see that. I'll say this could be you. If you don't tell me who did this, I'll make sure you end up the same way. Dead on your doorstep. Got it? I told you, I didn't kill her, and I don't know who did. Ugh, great. Just tell me who your employer is. I'd like to help you, but I can't. Why not? My brother and I, we got a thing about loyalty. We do our job, and we keep our mouths shut. If we don't hold up our end, we don't get paid. Your brother? Where was he last night? I can't say. He could have been anywhere. Take your best guess. He didn't do it, if that's what you're thinking. Then where is he? No, I'm not sending you after my brother. Look, I answered your question. Can I get my stuff back now? No, you can't. What did you find on it? Uh-uh. Oh, uh, nothing of consequence, really. Well, what did he have? Like, lint, lint balls and everything? Let me see. Yeah, a bunch of money and... This episode will have him going in circles. Talk He's to him. What is it now, Big B? Corroborate and you can go. You need to tell me where your brother is. Look, I know it's unpleasant. You don't want to be here, right? Exactly. I'm, I'm not trying to make tell things to difficult for you. I just need you to cooperate. Once you've answered my questions, I'll let you go. Yeah. 
It would help if I wasn't strapped to a chair. Fair enough. Look, Big B, this isn't going to work. Don't you want to find out what happened to those girls? To Snow White? Mm. Uh, let me handle this. I th I'd so where's your brother? Yeah. Look, mate, I'd like to help. I would, but I can't tell you where he is. Last time I saw him, we split up and I went to find Faith. I don't know where he is now, but he didn't kill anybody. What was that about Just Faith? Yeah, leave him me... out of this. Let's find out what you, you were talking about. Faith? Look, yeah. I went to her apartment. That's no secret. You saw me. No, there's more to it. You said you were trying to find something. Oh, yes. All right, D. What did you want from Faith? Sorry, I can't help you. I'm not saying any more about it. Okay, let me see here. D's cash. Just let me go, all right? I don't have any answers for you. You always carry this much cash. I've got a lot of laundry to do this week. What's it to you? Um, I'll pocket the money. <laughs> I'm a little evil I better bitch. get that back. Hmm, let me see. Should I talk? Uh, you know what? Mm, I did. Okay, I'll let him go. Come on, Dee. What did you want from Faith? Sweet girl like her. Sweet? You think that girl was sweet? Yeah, she was she sweet. She was a fucking thief. What? Fucking sweet. Faith was plenty of things. Um, what's she still? Fun. Yeah, I don't think I she mean, was a thief. You know what she did for a living, right? What, what did she, she steal? I don't know. Just some dumb thing my boss was after. Your boss? Well, that brings me back to my first question. Who are you working for? Yeah, Don't tell me. Get me in trouble, Big B. I can't answer any more of your questions. Oh, okay then. Uh, if you're not going to answer, then maybe I. Anyone sh can see this isn't. What is this? You just carry this around. Always handy that way. Hmm. Offer D a drink. Yeah, I'll offer him a drink. It couldn't hurt, I guess. Get him drunk. Get him drunk. He'll talk then. <laughs> I mean, I think it would work, wouldn't it? Why don't you just tell me who you're working for? Look, you're not a bad guy. I believe beauty on that one. But I can't give you that information. That's where I gotta draw the line. There's no way beauty would associate with a scumbag like you. What's wrong with me? You're telling me I ain't pretty enough? Yeah, we're real close. Okay, that's it. I, I can't take it. You're full of shit. Oh, we're good friends. That's enough. I will not tolerate this savagery. You think someone was trying to kill Snow? Isn't it more likely someone you was trying her to like get shit, back you by killing her? You want to talk about Snow? Yeah. You treated her like shit your whole career. Better take the blame for your incompetence. Now you can. What's going on down here? What the fuck? <gasps> She's alive! What the fudge? What? <laughs> oh, that's a good way to get me on. I was like, you, 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 you killed, you let her kill Snow. You think a good food zone did it? What, what the fuck? <gasps> oh, um, uh, yeah, this is hard to explain. Um, hmm. Angela's just gonna chew me out saying, Carson, you should have known that fables are hard to kill. And I'm like, I'm sorry! If it's a popular fable, they will not die easily. I'm sorry! I don't know this. Wow, what a great way to start an episode. Except for, like, The Walking Dead. That was a great way to start an episode. And a season, in fact. Alright, so I'm running out of time. Smoke and mirrors. I'm going to cut the video off at a good time. Right here. That's a good spot. I'm going to cut the video off right here, folks. Thank you very much for watching. Tune in the next. And let's see what happens to Big B and the return of Snow White, who's apparently alive. So, bye-bye.